I am black and I am a father. When I found out I was gonna be a father, I did not know what I was gonna do and I was scared This I didn't have my father, like the person who brought me into this planet. To this day, I don't really know who he is. The one thing I did know is that I was gonna change that. If there was one thing I knew, it was like I was not going to be like my father. I was gonna be there 100%, you know what I mean? I was gonna be the dad that's at the plays, Halloween in the outfits. I was gonna be that dad and that was just my motivation. But did I know what I was doing? Hell to the no. Hell no, I ain't know. Like I remember the first time I held my daughter, I was so scared because I thought I was gonna break her. So I definitely didn't know what I was doing. Who inspired me to be a good father? I'm gonna be honest, Uncle Phil. Uncle Phil was maybe the coolest dad on TV, man. Had the good outfits took in the nephew and was determined to make sure the kids all won and did everything he had to to make sure they had it. Uncle Phil, I'm gonna be honest, you know? My village is quite strong. Shout out to my mother-in-law, my aunt, my wife's aunts and cousins, sassy. You know what I mean? Major key into my village. There's a large amount of black women. My wife's best friend, Tima, that's another one of our godmothers into it. Like I have a large village and it's mainly women, so. Shout out to the black women in my planet. There are certain things, you know, like Sunday cleaning and music and just waking up on Sundays and vibing. I, I do that. Breakfast. I'm, I'm all about breakfast in the morning. I'm a very big breakfast dad. I wake up mad early and I get breakfast started. And just a lot of it, I'm, I'm winging it. I hate that whole baby daddy thing. If there's one thing that I hate, I hate when somebody be like, oh, my baby daddy. No, I don't like that. I'm not about that. I hate that. I despise it. I want that to be stopped. You know what I'm saying? Like sometimes just because the relationship doesn't work doesn't make that person less of a father because he's not in a relationship. You know what I mean? I just want that whole concept of black men, they take have these kids and run. I just want that whole kind of thing to stop. You know what I mean? Baby daddies and black men run from their kids. Because statistically, actually, if you look in the numbers, the black man is actually there more. This is actually a fact. And they realize that the black father in this new generation is actually much more hands-on with their kids than other races. And I didn't make this up. I just read it. So, you know, I think that that whole concept has got to change. You know what I mean? Like, I know some black dads that are there, man. Like, basketball games, graduations, plays. Girl Scouts, like yo, when I go to take my daughter to Girl Scouts, it's nothing but black dads. Shout out to the Girl Scout dads out there in America, you know what I'm talking about? I'll see y'all. The best part about being a dad for me is just the smiles on my kid's face, man. Like their happiness makes me happy. Just the happiness in their faces, you know, just that makes me just glow. You know what I mean? My heart explodes with happiness seeing them happy. So that's what it's all about.